can I just, uh, I, I know this, uh, channel is mostly about video games, but I gotta ask, like, why, why those fine, like, why, why do you, I can't even form the question, because I, I just can't wrap my mind around it. Why does Vine even exist, let alone have such a following? Ah, oh, it's just like six second videos, right? Six seconds. Why did someone have the idea to like say, hey, you know, I want to be a video content site, but it's only in six second clips. And then you know, he makes the app for iPhone and it takes off and it's like, what, did you people not send videos before or use YouTube? I mean, YouTube is perfectly capable of hosting six second videos as well as Facebook. I'm pretty sure Twitter has video, you know, Instagram, like, what, why, what, what, what the, oh, it's just what, why, what made it so popular? And now people are getting, like, really, they're trying to be really clever with them. And it's like, why not use that creativity and make a good, good length video? Like, the society's attention span is drastically, drastically decreasing. And, like, pretty soon, we're not even going to want to watch YouTube anymore because we're just going to watch six-second increments of our favorite television shows and you're going to have ads in between every six seconds and you're going to like it and you're going to watch it because hey it's six seconds you can watch it on the go you can watch it at work because you don't have to sit there and wait on those oh those those darn five minute videos or those darn ten minute videos or those darn fifteen minute videos my my videos recently are getting longer because I, I like extensive content and I've made videos that are longer than that before, and I've made videos that, you know, I generally, back in the day, when my channel was first starting up, I would try to make them between maybe at least 10 minutes or less. And now it's just like, whatever, YOLO, man. Because we can't even say you only live once anymore, it has to be YOLO. Sci like, we are dying as a people slowly, and it's starting with our language and, you know, our, our barriers pertaining to like media and entertainment because we have to or our our need for instant gratification is so bad that we need to have videos in six seconds like you have six seconds to tell a little story or to catch our attention or to make us laugh otherwise you are shit now to the general population that uses these iPhone apps which you know, again, the need for instant gratification. We need to have one device that has all these, you know, little applications that do little small things in order to create, you know, a, a slightly better life for us. But actually, it's making it worse because we get stressed over these stupid things like, you know, who, like Facebook likes, you know, everyone's begging for Facebook likes, trying to get Facebook likes. You know, they're, they're feeling better about themselves when they get Facebook likes when it's and it doesn't mean anything when these Facebook pages ask for like oh 15 likes and I'll post a picture of this or I'll you know do a video on this likes don't mean anything they're nothing they they don't really mean people like you they like the, the picture like if you're a hot girl people are just gonna generally like it because they want to you know, it's like breaking the ice. You like a photo, and then you're like, oh, hey, I really like this photo. It's like part of that. It's like Facebook etiquette is an, a, a thing now. You have to like people's statuses before you can, you know, you know, comment. Or you, you, if you like someone's comment but not the status, then that means that, you know, you, you, you're you basically, it feels like you're saying the status isn't good enough. It's like an insult because, oh, hey, you posted a dumb status. I'm not even going to, you know, acknowledge it with my own comment. I'm just going to like someone else's comment. It's just these things are becoming a part of our daily life and that annoys me to no end because maybe I'm old school but you know I just don't see the need or or not even the brevity thing like people are like oh it's brevity man oh it's just you know making the most out of six seconds but you don't have to that's the thing you, don't, you shouldn't have to the vine is cutting your creative in, like juices shorter than what they could be because of the six second length you could be making these great videos and now look at this video going on five minutes you know how many viewers I'm gonna lose because this video is going over five minutes now just just 
now, passing the five minute mark. You know how many people are going to click turn off this video before they finish it? A lot of people. And you know, uh, this video is not even going to get that many likes in the first place, but a lot of people aren't even going to want to watch this because it's five minutes long. <laughs> and that's just sad to me. And Vine is sad. And you know, I, I, I sure, you know, don't. Don't take this as me bashing the people who make vines because there, there's a lot of dumb vines, but there's also some people that have really creative ideas and are really, you know, quick with the camera. They can do quick edits and stuff, but they just waste their talents on these six-second videos that, you know, go viral or whatever, but they don't get anything out of it. Like, who's going to be who's gonna be the first famous person on Vine? Who's going who's gonna to be that first person that breaks through and, ha and develops a successful career out of making six-second videos? I want to shake that guy's hand and then also, you know punch him in the face for for being so for being successful on something so dumb. I don't know. That's just my opinion on it and I guess, you know, sorry sorry about this rant, but yeah. <laughs> Later guys.